Welcome back. So, just going over the uh, aftermath of yesterday's derecho in, well, mostly just in the yard. Um, as you guys see, this branch went down. Um, wasn't due to lightning, it was due to that wind. Um, not sure where it came from, but I don't think it came from there. I think it came from higher up. Because I don't see where it broke off right there. Um, I honestly do not know where this came from because that did not, it's from the same tree and all. It just is not from where it broke. Um, got more branches and stuff down, but more concerned about, yeah. Where's the, where did it come from is what I'm curious about. Where did that thing come from? Because you'd see a break right there if it was from there. This came from higher up in the tree. I'm not sure where in the tree, but it's from higher up in the tree. Um, it's kind of moss co covered, so it's like definitely further up. Might not have been tied to this tree. Might have been tied to that larger tree. And it just happened to fall through. We got more branches up there that's kind of detached. Might be related. Um, I am not sure where this tree was, that branch was. But, yeah. By the way, let's move on for some more storm damage here. Um, just a minor thing with the wheelbarrow get knocked over um which i'll just tip it completely over to drain the water so so skeeters can't use it as a breeding ground um although i doubt they'd be able to use that little bit of water but there we go so that's done we do have some small branches over here, small sticks down. So not a lot of damage. And you guys saw that the windmill that she threw out because it broke again. And she's just done with it. Um, that's why you guys get those hooks that have the latch on them. Um, so they don't have that issue. We also got that there, which that was dead already. So just needed aid get knocked down um um but there's that probably some more that's gonna come down in the next few storms um also keep an eye for any wildlife that's probably active all of a sudden because of the rain i mean occasionally you have turtles out here snakes crawdads and it's just got to be careful with that. Especially with the snakes because some of them might be venomous. Um, luckily, the ones that are normally deadly venomous, you hear before you see them in this area. Got more branches down, but nothing. Stuff that is already pretty much dead is just waiting for it to come down. Uh, that's what's been coming down. Um, more of that over there. But this is a branch that we're waiting to come down, but it didn't budge. It was bouncing a little bit, but it's still up. It's still hanging. It's not attached to anything, but it's still hanging. It's mostly just attached to this rope to keep it up. Still ready to take it down. Are these edible? I'm assuming that they're not edible and not mess with them, but if they're edible, awesome. But they're probably not even ripe, and I heard the buzzing. Um, but yeah, that's about it for damage in this yard. There might be more damage elsewhere in town. But yeah, you can see it's not connected to anything. It's been hanging up all winter for the most part. It's hanging on to that branch, which we had to get that branch down at this point. This entire tree's dead. Um, 
by the looks of it. So, yeah. Shouldn't be too hard to take it down. Still some live branches, so I'm not sure. Maybe the disease and getting over the disease. Or just some dead branches. Um. Either way, there's something there. Um. But yeah. That's about it for damages here. Um. Just minor tree damage. Wheelbarrow got knocked over. That's about it. Windmill dis uh, wind chime destroyed. <sighs> I'd say mostly because of that. It's like $10 in damage. Damages. No big deal. Um, but yeah. That's about it. Stay safe out there. See you in the next video. Bye.